Hey, this is Paul with ConvertingCopy.com. I got a quick tip tutorial for you today, all you Drupal users. Anyone who has ever seen the trusted host settings error not enabled. So the trusted host pattern setting needs to be configured in settings.php because that leads to security vulnerabilities, which they outline right here, uh, basically preventing your site from thinking it is someone else. So what we're going to be doing is whitelisting our own domain name uh, within our Drupal information within the settings folder or file right here so that uh, we don't have this error anymore and we patch up that security vulnerability. So all you have to do for this, you can do it right there in your uh, C panel of your hosting provider. Locate the settings.php file. I've got it right here. We're still working in the Paul Ventura music uh, root folder right here. But it's, uh, it's within the sites folder of your Drupal installation. Sites, default, and right there, settings.php. Now note that you're going to have to, edit, uh, in order to edit the settings.php file, you need to change a couple of permissions, including the, uh, the default folder, as well as the settings.php files themselves. Otherwise, you're not gonna be able to change anything. So this is just temporary. Make sure you set it back when you're done. But basically, once you change those permissions to allow writing, you can just change permissions right there and just tick everything to be writable just for the moment and then uh, go ahead click edit I've already done that and come down all the way to the bottom of your settings.php and you're going to type in this code and uh, I'm gonna put it in the description of this video but basically you're going to replace Paul Ventura music in this case let's just type in example and write it down here as well example so this is the uh, this is the code that you need to copy and paste into your site, replacing example with whatever your domain name is, and then uh, just basically click click save changes, and this is going to tell your website, your Drupal installation, that this domain is whitelisted. It can trust everything that comes from it, and that should take care of this error message as well. Let's just check that. So I'm going to put in my domain name right there and save changes now we're good to go and let's go ahead and revert the permissions on that this really just needs to be read when you're not writing it so let's just go back set that to all fours and then uh, up one level and change this default folders permissions back back to read and execute and we should be good to go Let's go back to our status report section in our domain, refresh, and we should see this disappear. And there it goes. All right. So that is how you fix that trusted host patterns error and provide more security for your Drupal run site. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. I do these videos all the time. I am Paul with ConvertingCopy.com. I'll see you next time.